Hey guys, I'm going to do a little update on the uh, cyanuric acid. Okay, this pool here that we're at, um, this is the one that went through like four gallons of chlorine. And uh, this time it had a gallon of chlorine left in the, in the container. And so we use a less, less chlorine so far. And the conditioner in this thing before was about 32 um, for the spin touch. And I bumped it up last week and now it's 54. And we went from a, a chlorine reading of before of 0.62 to now a chlorine reading of 3.1. Now, what I did it here, um, I bumped it up even more, I put another about a pound and a half in, the, in there again, and we're gonna get this thing up to about maybe 70, and we're gonna see what we're, uh, where we go from there. But so far, just from going from 30 to 54 ppm of cyanuric acid, we have a good, you know, two ppm more of chlorine in this pool. And uh, this is the first time I've come to this pool since I bumped it up. I'm not gonna go 30, 50 anymore. That, that's a done deal for me. I'm going 70 to 80 in all my pools. Um, that's where I'm going. And, you know, it seems like every time I want to brought my pools down uh, to 30 and 50, nothing but problems, nothing, not, not algae problems, but I mean, you go there and, you know, there's just no chlorine and you're going through two or three gallons of chlorine. So, you know what? Um, yeah, I don't know why we're told 30 to 50 ppm of chlorine. I, I mean, it's a conditioner. I have no idea. Maybe because uh, the worried about guys getting that conditioner level way up and not bringing the alkalinity up with it and uh, causing all these corrosive pools. I don't know. But the thing is, and what I understand, is uh, it takes 10 ppm of cyanic acid to hold 1 ppm of chlorine. Now, if that's the case, then why are we told 30 to 50 ppm? So I mean, every time we come to a pool, we pour in a gallon of chlorine, and that gallon of chlorine in a 10,000 gallon pool is gonna be, or 20,000 gallon pool is gonna be six PPM. So uh, um, you're talking, uh, that's gonna be off gassing. Anything above like five PPM is gonna be used up quick. You're just gonna waste that chlorine, and then the conditioner will hold on to the rest. Um, if it depends on what you have. If you have um, 30 PPM in there, you're gonna have, be burning off all the way down to 3 ppm and then that 3 ppm is gonna have the hold all week long so this way here if you think about it if it's 70 to 80 um, you're gonna be holding you know, when you pour in a couple gallons of chlorine or a gallon of chlorine in a, in a 10,000 gallon pool um, you know you're gonna hold a lot more chlorine now you're gonna hold 7 ppm of chlorine and 8 ppm of chlorine instead of the 3 ppm of chlorine and this is why we're probably having so many problems with these pools um, because we're, you know, guys like me, um, okay, well, they say, hey, you know, you're wasting your money on condition over 50 ppm. Well, I don't think so, and, uh, and that's what I'm proving right now. Um, no, we're not wasting our money. Now, the thing is, why are we told that? I don't know. Um, all my pools are going up to 70 and 80, and this one here is just it's proof. Proof. This pool here was a, um, about a 30, say mid 30s on the cyanuric acid, 0.62. Um, chlorine every single time I came even with three gallons in the jug and a gallon in the pool um, and now there was a gallon left in the tank and uh, the pool looks great here's the pool got um, got no usually get a little bit of mustard right in that area there nothing nice and clean this pool is nice and clean. Um, and we got three ppm of chlorine in this pool and a gallon left in the tank. So, um, that goes to show you right there, man. Uh, you know what, honestly, a 30 to a 50, and now we're holding better chlorine. And next week, I'm gonna take a little video again, and I'm gonna find out if we're even better at 70 to 80. Um, and you go, I got two more gallons, I got about three gallons total in the tank. And I'm going to put a, um, not even going to really put anything in the pool. Um, so we're just going to go off the three gallons in the tank, nothing in the pool. Okay. And um, so I'll keep you posted again next week. All right. Later.